reckless moves to instant regret. Hello. Here are some instances when these idiot drivers got an instant reality check from the cops. You are dead. Buckle up as we're diving into those priceless moments when lawbreakers got a full dose of police justice. Bro successfully passed five cars and then got a surprise on the sixth one. I bet he never thought he would throw that smoke grenade and a cop would just happen to pass by. When you are so drunk, you forget it's not your license that you are handing out to the cop, but your bank card. Can I see your driver's license? Yes, you can, sir. You been drinking any alcohol today? No. Nothing. Collections for them. What's that? What's this? That's my bank card. Why are you giving me a bank card? When you decide to roll through a stop sign, you ought to see no one's recording you. Hothead promptly got out of his car and was ready to fight. I'll end you! That is till he realized he was up against a cop. Uh-oh. Bye, have a great time. Cops were like, um, sir, that's not how to make smoke for a music video. You're coming with us to the station. <laughs> Instant karma struck again as this dude's road rage backfired big time. Look at this dude. He has lost his book. He's still In 2.9 miles, turn right. Uh oh, to uh oh, uh oh, snap. Get him. Get him. Hope that's the law. Yeah. Yeah! Get it, baby! This guy was not only crossing the double yellow lines, but was also justifying it. So karma became inevitable. And this red light runner that day learned why it's always a good idea to be patient while driving. Few minutes later. And now watch the real life version of GTA. Oh. Red Hill. There he goes, right through the red light. Oh! Officer's ready there for him. Oh, he just hit that car! Unfortunately, in this version, there was no cheat code like, leave me alone. He's got trouble right there. How's he gonna get around this? Oh, it looks like it's a female. He pushed her out of the vehicle. Ugh. Wow, right up on the grass and continues on. This is a. Uh... Oh, he's out on foot now. He's trying to run. By the way, apart from all that, it's perfectly looking like they have handed over the mic to a WWE commentator to cover this story. Business complex, business area, he's got the dog coming at him. The dog takes it down right there, 12 o'clock. The dog got him, the dog made the tackle right before he got into the All these guys waiting in line are idiots. Let me go across the board. Uh-oh, where'd these cops come from? Denied. <laughs> Annoyed by the extreme honking, Indian police installed this tool on signals which increase red light time if sound pollution rises up from a specific level. We connected decibel meters to a few signal poles around the city. If the decibel level went over 85 dB, the signal would reset and stay red for longer. <laughs> This traffic controller was more interested in bikers than this car, dude. But with that crazy move, he totally changed this officer's priorities. FBI, open up! This vehicle was a little bit overloaded, so the cops decided to get it off the road. Man! I wonder how he managed to drive it. I am a super genius. And this dude instantly got what he deserved. Yeah, now you'll surely get some time in jail to think about your priorities. This idiot driver recklessly split the lanes, exited the highway successfully, and then landed straight into the arms of this cop. 
This police car was definitely on some other task, but with that, Bro instantly changed their priorities. So that's what can go wrong when you touch things you shouldn't. Cop literally nailed it. This last minute left turner got a rude awakening when he missed the cop right in plain sight. And that's what we call perfect timing. This idiot came flying down the street thinking there'll be no cops up there, but unfortunately, this state trooper was just leaving for work. Enemy spotted. The sudden stop did it for me. I mean, it's like he was saying, nice to meet you, sir. Yeah, nice wheelie. Now get your bike off the road, I gotta talk to you. Okay. Imagine doing this, and that too, right in front of a cop car. <laughs> this dog was living his best life, but only until the cops showed up. Then he walked away quietly, leaving his owner arrested. <laughs> How about this crazy idea of skipping a traffic jam? Yep, seems pretty good, but only until this. He tried jumping the queue, but thanks to these cops, coming back into it became impossible for him. It's Richard the second, David, not Jesus the first. He must be like, please give me a ticket, but don't do this sh to me. <laughs> he tried his best to dodge these cops, but they replied, no, dear, not today. By the way, Bro just got an incredible story for his grandkids. Rules? Yeah, never heard of them. But after this, they sure will. Yep, driving the wrong way, are we? Feeling gangsta. Yeah, a little bit of a Too bad that didn't work. This dude showed up out of nowhere and ended up straight where a good drunk Samaritan should. <laughs> cop was like, whoa, this lamb came to slaughter himself. This cop here ended up pulling over his own boss. Guess who I just pulled over? Hey. Yarborough. Really? Yeah, the chief deputy driving a Dodge Charger, a souped up Dodge Charger belongs to the sheriff's office. I just clocked this son at 96 in a 35. Really? Awkward. Doesn't even cover it. Sir, here's your ID back. This is your copy of the citation. Yeah, if you would sign right here. It's got a court date, time it's a must appear. Please slow down and have a safe day. The little skips in the start had me, along with the too tight tracksuit. And his running? That was the cherry on top. Biker was cruising along when the cop said, heck no. Huh? Never gonna learn, yeah. Stop the car! Stop the car! Stop it! This suspect was like, I'm gonna get out of here whether the cop stays on the hood or not. Yep, one way or another. This cop's dash cam captured a driver tearing through the roads of Louisiana. <laughs> Little did he know, he was gonna end up like this. And that's simply how to get arrested, even without a warrant. And Ms. Curtis, thank you for telling me who you are this time. Last time you didn't. He thought he escaped at a perfect time, but nope, he was kind of wrong. Okay. 
just sitting at the top right here. But why is he running? He doesn't even have a warrant. No warrant, Robert! Ah, drop it. But that's math, ain't it? Uh, how stupid, dude. Yeah, since I drive the Ferrari, I can just ignore the police, right? Wait, that's not the case? Oh, dear. First, he punched the guy and then had the audacity to go sit in his car. Well, not on the watch of these guys, nope, cause luck was in their favor and they called the cops on him. Look at him, just drifting about, being in his own element. And the cop car was like, surprise, you idiot! Not only did he run over the biker's foot, he was totally clueless about the lane markings. Got the lesson of a lifetime. <laughs> Fleeing the scene of an accident. Way to make things worse for yourself. Now, this idiot driver was found doing donuts on a very busy road and apparently was so far gone, the cop had to stop him like this. Oh, you, you oh, go, baby, you go, baby, you go. Caught, baby, you 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 caught, baby. And here comes the real definition of I've got time today. It was totally his fault. Still, he called the cops and then got busted instantly. Brake checking on a busy highway isn't such a good idea in itself, but doing this right in front of the cops is some next level idiocy indeed. <laughs> Cut off his way first and then was even ready to argue about it, but thankfully this officer stepped in just in time. This idiot thought he owned the road, hence took that U-turn without looking around, but unfortunate for him, he picked the wrong vehicle to cut off. Yeah, an absolute ticket. <laughs> Pissed off by too many tickets, this truck driver decided to surrender to the officer. She's copying speeding ticket. The car in front of me, ticket. I'm gonna speed it. I can't drive, I give you the key of the truck. I can't you drive. Can, you can drive. Well, instead of handing over keys, wouldn't it be better to learn about traffic laws? And meanwhile, this quick-thinking cop literally roasted this sovereign citizen. Have a look. You were receiving infringement notice in the mail for failing to wear a seatbelt, okay? Do your best. So what are your details, if that's right? Just your name and date of birth. Yep, so so, I, so I'm, am I under obligation to give you that yep, license? so you provided to give me your By name. law? Yep, so it's the Summary Offences Act, which is 458. Act, it's on law. Yep. You, you agree on the man? I don't know. I don't, I'm not going to assume your gender, sir. Do you agree I, on the I man? I don't know what you identify as. A living man. I'm alive. So yeah, you, haven't, totally you haven't stipulated to me that law where I have to give you my license. The Summary Offences Act. Your mobile phone is there. You're more than welcome to look up the Summary Offences Act. Go for it. Act as I'm law. Thanks to her logic, this dumb lady managed to get arrested over just broken brake lights. What crime have I been suspected you of committing? No brake lights. Is that a crime, officer? Yes, give me a license. According to People vs. Battle, traffic infractions are not crimes. So we can break traffic laws and don't have to get in trouble as long as no one gets hurt. What crime have I been suspected of committing? No brake light. We need your, we need your <sighs> license. According to People vs. Battle, traffic infractions are not crimes. Well, it simply means I can drive drunk as long as I want, unless I don't hit anyone, right? Now, have a look how polite this truck driver is. He even opened the car door for the cops. And this officer instantly passed through an utter wave of surprise and confusion after this. 14. Ma'am, is this your car? This is my fiance's. Your fiance? I uh, know, I just heard him not supposed to be driving when I'm pregnant. I wasn't sure. But How old are you? 
Me, I'm 18. Okay. I mean, I literally have the pregnancy test right here. One, two, three, three. Just got it. Just, I'm shocked. Bro really needs a hug, doesn't he? Um, you're actually, you might be the youngest person, like, born most recently that I've ever pulled over. I've never pulled over someone from 09. Instead of giving his documents, he decided to mess with the cops and then regretted it instantly. You're a f***ing little bitch. Give me my ticket and go f*** yourself. In five got his gun on me now. He's hitting my f***ing truck now. And I'm, he's breaking my window. Assaulting a police get in, get in here. Help me. Help me. And this insurance scam went a little bit out of plan. See for yourself. Amid a car crash, police had closed that road, but the curiosity of this idiot was pushing him ahead. So the cops had to stop him in a bit of a harsh way. <laughs> Driving skills of these thieves are incredible, but meanwhile, cops too nailed it. Yeah, you can't escape these super cops. <laughs> This police chase was indeed a serious matter, but through his hilarious commentary, this news anchor turned this story into a whole new way. Have a look. Back You're now, telling me he's coming he doesn't through, have yeah. any pants on or well, is he wearing he, shorts? It's he, a hot day. He might be wearing shorts in a hot day in Atlanta, but he, uh, he could also have lost his pants. He certainly lost his truck. Look at the fuel tanks on the side of that thing. All he's got to do, there it goes, oh. whoop-de-doo. Is this guy armed who carjacked this poor truck owner? I mean, you just don't know. Does truck owner jump? Indeed he does. Oh my goodness. 15 cops around him. Sir, it's over. Get out. We have other news. Look, luckily, we have 24 hours of the news day. Tried to avoid that traffic jam in an illegal way, but this unexpected surprise was waiting for him ahead. A confirmed ticket, isn't it? After watching him coming in the wrong way, this cyclist decided to stand his ground. Back, go back. You're on the wrong side of the road. Go back. Go back. Go back. You assault me, I'm going to call the police. Hey Siri, dial nine. It was getting worse when these cops made a surprising entry. Yeah, he just kept, he, he drove into me, not very hard, but uh, a couple of times he forced me to fall into the bonnet. Yeah, now he'll never repeat this mistake anytime soon. And this karma was even faster than instant. Brandy Tiba's just so pissed, she sees a couple drum supporters, whatever, so she starts freaking out, screaming, her head's exploded, she's throwing the uh, middle fingers, double birdie, all that. And then all of a sudden, Booyah almost crashes into that car in front of her. Luckily, she didn't. Commentator literally nailed it. <laughs> and that's what we call a real bad day. <sighs> this perfect U-turn perfectly tells what will happen next. Someone's gonna get an obvious ticket. Sir, sir. Please, don't arrest this man. I just gave him some money. He's, he's a nice guy. Bro tried being the savior angel of this homeless man, but the cop replied, Please, sir, look at your own stuff first. This, you're not trying to arrest him, are you? Why are you stopping? Because I thought you were trying to arrest this man. All right. Okay, sorry. All right, cool. Yeah, but you know the cops saw that he stopped in the middle of the road for that? These cops thought they were above the law, hence were speeding in a school zone. But then this cop came up to remind them that law enforcers too are supposed to obey the law. How you doing? 36 miles per hour in a 15 mile per hour zone. This the line is right there at the school. I'm in. The, I'm on the sidewalk, dude. You're busted, man. Look at your problem. So, next time, make it sure to check the back view mirror twice before splitting lanes. Go get him! Oh, yeah, baby, go get him! He was blocking the freeway just for taking a selfie and then got rewarded instantly for this stupidity. Turning a busy road into a boxing ring, and that too in front of cops, wasn't such a wise idea at all. See for yourself.
Miss Karen was on her routine duty to annoy people when an undercover cop noticed her and taught her a lesson. This guy was disobeying the bicycle laws. Yay! Yeah. Just, I just... You see that? I would like her arrested, I yes. Bro lost it with him over talking crap about his car, but then it turned out and found out that he mistakenly messed with an undercover cop. That dude pepper spraying himself literally had me. Annoyed by the blocked road, this idiot tried charging these protesters with an axe. Fortunately, the cops were there to stop him. This guy in the yellow shirt was tasked by the city police to check whether cars stop at this pedestrian crossing or not. And this is what happened. This gasoline fight was escalating, but luckily this cop showed up just in time. She tried to block a motorcyclist from a zipper merge. Then karma shifted into high gear and delivered instant justice. Well, folks, always stop for a school bus or be ready for this. Yeah, a confirmed ticket. These dudes know how to party. And meanwhile, these dudes know how to arrest idiots. This was a permanent school bus stop, but drivers never prefer to stop here for this school bus. So this lady asked the sheriff to help them, and this is how they resolved the issue. Pull over. Park on the side of the road. What goes around comes around, and this man instantly got what was coming around. Have a look. Oh, and now you got the cop. Yeah, he, he spit on the guy. This biker popping a wheelie met his match when a mounted City of London police officer trotted in to give him a lesson in street smarts. Don't give me any old flannel, alright? Yeah, sorry, sir. You know, kill someone else as well as yourself, you know? Sorry. Myself, I know how fast they are, but don't try and give me any old flannel. Alright, all right? thank you, sir. It won't happen again. Bro passed a stopped school bus and then quickly learned that some mistakes don't let you get very far. This underground parking was two layers down, so he thought it safe to show some crazy skills and then instantly got a surprise. The van thought it could cut through the grass and sidewalk like a stealthy ninja. But then these cops crashed the party. That is a sidewalk, dude. <laughs> Please. Yeah. Nothing, just an entitled Karen receiving a shutdown call by the cops. Record all you want, okay? Thank you so much. And now comes the worst timing ever in the history of illegal fireworks. Bro pulled off a 360 in his car and then the cop chimed in with a surprise of his own. Game over, buddy. And that's the reason, that's exactly the reason why you should always avoid crossing a double line.
Busted instantly, wasn't he? Now what to say about this one? Yeah, it was slick as heck. Um, why is this barrier here? Let's remove it. Uh-oh. Actually, I was just trying to fix it. The drifter's car stopped right in front of the cop's car, just like a real-life game of stop, drop, and get caught. And meanwhile, this reckless driver got an instant reality check from the cops. This dude attempted to overtake a long queue using the oncoming lane for a left turn and then received an unexpected greeting from the cop coming from ahead. He was driving at 150 in an area of 80 and was even splitting lanes. <coughs> Thankfully, cops served him instant justice before he crashed into someone. Using a cell phone right in front of an officer was definitely not a good choice, and he realized it after getting caught red-handed. Having a bad day? All right, then watch this. Now think again. Are you having a worse day than him? Violated a stop sign in front of cops and then got busted instantly. Have a look! And here's a quick instruction manual on how to get arrested. Enemy spotted. <laughs> yes! Bro not only ran the red light, but even behaved like it wasn't his fault at all. So karma became inevitable for him. With that, Bro tried taking this road rage at a whole new level. But uh-oh, that wasn't part of the plan. And that's why you should never change lanes blindly. Adding twist, Bro crashed right into the police car and made his ticket confirmed. He thought he successfully dodged cops, but nope, there was also another challenge ahead. Ooh. 